so for my client and um, for this class for PR I know that they don't use um, search engine optimization or SEO because um, I I've never known how to do that and I know in the army we actually have um, higher headquarters doing the SO SEO so for for ROTC, I believe they don't do that because we do fall under the big army cadet command and they're the ones who have the capability to do so. And funding wise, like it's just not one of the things that um, ROTC does. Um, also, another thing that I know for um, for army ROTC, we don't use a lot of influencer or advocate management or engagement because um, it's uh it's a quick transition so we once a cadet graduates in commission they go out and be a officer in the army so it's sometimes we can't reach them immediately but there are times that we actually do have some lieutenants that are successful in the army and have them talk about army rotc especially for university of wyoming and I think that's one thing that we can capitalize more on and, and reach out to our um, successful lieutenants within the Army, especially the active duty Army lieutenants. We do some some of them that, who graduates like um, the Ranger School and stuff like that, They we would ask them to send us photos, send us some quotes, and talk about um, what they've done in the ranger school or air assault school or airborne school and how those opportunities are great opportunities for cadets to actually join um join UW army rotc so they can also experience those things um yeah and also like you know using brand advocates like they would be brand advocates because they're not paid i mean they were just um, basically alumni who graduated from the university and become successful in the army. So I think those are the two things that we need to focus on, um, try to figure out a way to use SEO and also um, encourage more influencer advocate engagement from our alumni that graduated from UW Army ROTC. Um, we do have some micro influencers, I believe, but it's not a lot. So I think we can capitalize on those and actually maximize those chances of our opportunities of having them talk about UW Army ROTC. And that's what I got for this week.